the word is how we, we... I have an app. I can put it on. Alright. Uh, oh, yeah, you might have a thing going on. <laughs> <laughs> Which one are we doing first? Cornbread? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah. You guys don't have to count. <laughs> Hi, I'm Austin. And I'm Tom. Hi, I'm Rachel. And today we're gonna cook cornbread. Can you say bake cornbread? <laughs> you bake. You'll, bake you'll say all bread. that. Hey guys, I'm Austin. And I'm Tom. Hi, I'm Rachel. And we're gonna make some cornbread today. Not a lot of people can pour stuff from a bowl as well as I can. That was very really, okay. Really good. So I'm gonna get the extra. Yeah, there. You, just, you did really good. I tried my best. Yeah. So we're just gonna lightly stir all of our extra stuff in here first, just to give it like a little coat of the cornmeal. And now I'm going to have you slowly pour that in for me. <laughs> this is the moment of truth. Yep. Keep going. You're good. Some people wait a uh, <laughs> lifetime for a moment like this. I'm this, really just hanging on by a thread here, guys. This is the moment. Oh, man. Is that you too got, slow? No, go ahead. Just keep going. You got it. I don't feel like go good, nothing's happening. No, I mean, it is. You could go a little bit more aggressive. Yep. There this is, this is kind of medium slow. This is okay-ish Okay, so slow. we're, we're okay-ish slow at the moment. Okay. Word of the day. You're doing really good. Yep. I try hard. Mm -hmm. I really good came shows. into this yeah. with... with Perseverance that I was going to do this perfectly. You're doing great. I'm not even going to move. A little move. bit more. A little bit more. Yep, there you go. Okay. 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 So we are going to mix this up. You don't want to over mix cornbread. That is how you get really dry, not what we want. So we're basically just going to mix this. Is there a way you could tell that you've over mixed it? Well, you can't this really tell it? until it's baked. So if it comes out really dry and crumbly and kind of like tough, then you know that you over mixed it. It's either you've over mixed it or you've added too much flour. So if you have a good recipe, if you still get a bad result, it's probably because you have mix. So we literally just want everything to be wet. So this is literally the most work we've ever done prepping anything. This is true. It's <laughs> a very important tip, too. Make sure you write that down. Usually we just throw seasoning on stuff <laughs> and say, like, check out this. Well, see, after I mix this and get it in the pan, I'm going to let you guys throw that stuff on top. Can we, do like, can we do like the salt bay guy? You, yeah, you can get crazy. <laughs> Frankie, you can He would this. really like for me to drop some of this. Go ahead. Sit right there. <clears throat> sit, buddy. Sit. Sit. All right. right there. Sit. So, okay, we haven't mixed. There's still a few little dry pieces, but that is fine. So, we're going to go into our greased pan. You just greased that with cooking spray? Uh, yeah, some, some cooking oil. You can use uh, butter if you want. I just like oil because I feel like butter can sometimes burn. 
So we're just gonna be a little cautious. Look at that. That just looks great. It looks like a not overmixed <laughs> corn. Yeah, look at that not overmixing the grape. Alright. So we're done with that. Press this out a little bit. And then I just saved a little bit of jalapeno and some cheddar and we're gonna put it back across the top. Tom, oh. why, don't you, why don't you handle the cheese and then I can give you this one a coat? We just want a little bit of like that crispy cheese on top. Alright. Can't go wrong with crispy cheese. No, look at Her. that. I've been waiting for this my whole life. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. I tried real hard. Just try it. That's the cheese that's going to give it a little bit more moisture. Like that food. Moisture. <laughs> Q moisture. We had to go there. Yeah, we had to go there. Our first episode, we, we said moist probably like 50 times. So I just got bored when I was editing, and I just put a picture of the little moist lady <laughs> name over top oh of it. Oh my gosh. Moist. Perfect. It had high viewership. That's true. One guy said he would it was a 9 out of 10. He would watch it again. Just because of that part? Probably. That's what I'm going to say. I mean, yeah. Let's go. We'll call him and ask him. He's our only fan. Oh. <laughs> He's really not that hard hey, to get Hey, I'm a fan. Off. That doesn't yeah. count. He lives in Cleveland. We have two fans. So this will go in the oven at 375 for 35-ish minutes. We'll right. check it just to make sure, yeah. <laughs> on the bottom. We don't want any dark spots. We'll give it about 15 more minutes, then it'll be done. Like there's two different styles of cornbread. You can do like a northern and a southern style. Okay. So the southern style usually has a little bit more sugar in it and a couple more eggs. So it gives it that like cake-like flavor. Like that nice. springy. Yeah, I think it'll be good. All right, so we got our cornbread out of the oven. Uh, we let it sit for about 10 minutes, just to let it cool down. Uh, I melted a little bit of butter and added some honey. We're just gonna drizzle it a little bit on here and then we're gonna have the guys try it. This is far more advanced than anything <laughs> we can pull off on our own. Yeah, yeah, this is. We just have to go a little bit extra. I mean, it's a special, right? I don't know, this is. We're a different kind of special. <laughs> yeah. All right. You guys go ahead. All right. Let's go for it here. Even if it's bad, please just say it's good. <laughs> <laughs> that is very good. Acceptable? No, it's real. It's really good. It's good. Really good. 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 <laughs> it's, not, it's not dry. Good. Not perfect, spicy. perfect amount of uh, stirring. Yeah. Oh, see? You guys did great. I think it's my dumping. Yeah, I think yeah. the dumping definitely helps. That's true. Yeah. But it's legit. The topping really kind of sets it off. Yep. Yeah. The jalapeno see. gives it just enough kick to make it interesting. So, very good. Yeah. I'm glad you guys like it. 
<laughs> it does leave a mess. <laughs> Got the perfect crumble there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you guys have the beard though, so it just it catches all. Of I it. usually just save it for later. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's perfect. Yeah. Someone Frank you be pleased. Oh yeah, he is down here <laughs> getting all of the crumbs. He's Frank you scooping. He <laughs> Well, thanks for being on the show yeah. and cooking some more bread yeah, for us. Really yeah. Neat. Did a hell of a job. Thank you. All right, guys. Until next time. All right. Hi, guys. I'm Rachel, also known as Fierce Booty. Uh, you can find me on Instagram or Twitter. Um, and I am here shooting with the Hill Grillies. I just have to throw in that Tom sucks. Don't tell him I said that.